finished off here. I didn't have to uh, cardboard on the inside as long as you tape it off well enough. Shouldn't have any problem with the uh, plastic dip hitting the radiator. I just need to put the uh, drape around the outside and we can start painting. First coat, about 50% coverage or so. Coat number two done. Did get a little bit of overspray up in here, but uh, microfiber cloth will wipe that right off later. And coat number three. Layer number four. Held it in one spot a little too long right there. out of it so that should be all right I think I'll go with one more layer and throw the gloss fire on all right five layers it's just about one can there's just a little bit left and that little uh, run spot that I was worried about on layer number four dried out just fine kind of got a little bit of something there but uh, I think that'll dry out very well so I'll give it 10 more minutes here, and I'll throw one or two layers of the uh, clear coat on. We'll see how that looks. Alrighty, just threw the uh, gloss on there. That's kind of where we're sitting at right now. If I was a better painter, the gloss would come out a little bit better, but uh, I don't think it's too bad. Debate on whether or not I want to do one more layer of gloss just to smooth things out or we'll call it good from there. I mean, it's already set up, so I might as well just do the one extra layer. And after that, we'll let it uh, dry up a little bit and peel it off. Uh, lots of overspray up here. Can't really see it. Um, right here, you can see that I just took a microfiber towel and wiped it right there. It came right off. And that's what it was before. As you can see, it just uh, rubs off. Might take a little while because uh, as I spring upwards on the grill, everything was kind of wafting up and landing up here. All right, here we are done painting five layers of black and two layers of the gloss. Just gotta wait 10, 15 minutes for it to dry, remove all the tape, and uh, we all done. Overall, Project turned out fairly well. The wind kicked up a little bit during my project. Got a little piece of dust stuck to it right there. But you know what? That's the worst thing to happen when this project's all said and done. I'm uh, fairly positive. Recommendations uh, in the future is uh, when you have about five foot of this drop, go ahead and put it all the way up there because uh, the overspray, it stops about here, which is a majority of that hood, so I'm going to be spending some time uh, wiping all this uh, overspray off, and there's quite a bit of it. So, I'll get this cleaned up, and then uh, I'll do a shot of it all finished. I, I didn't know how hard this would be, so I started this without having the camera, but uh, I just wanted to basically show you guys literally how simple this is. So, I'm going to continue that the rest of the way around and uh, I'll get back to you guys. All done. All the overspray has been buffed off, so that's all clean now. Moved all the tape, good clean edges. Uh, I did get a little overzealous. You saw how easy it was pulling off down there. Then when I came around up here, right about center line, it started catching just a little bit. So I got a little bit of a tear right there. And then if 
Further down here, you guys can see a couple of spots where the chrome is showing through. Right there. But uh, other than that, it turned out pretty good. A couple of lessons learned here. Take your time when you're peeling the paint or the tape, uh, peeling the uh, plastic tip around the edges. Definitely take your time. Take some time when you're uh, laying your drop cloth because that took a lot of time buffing all that out. And uh, yeah, there's one more lesson in here somewhere. But uh, yeah, just definitely don't rush the project. It turned out really, really well. I think it looks a lot better than the chrome. I can peel this center piece off, but you know, for right now, I don't think it looks bad. So I'm just gonna leave it as that. Uh, Leave it that way. Uh, stay tuned. Next step is going to be plastic dipping the wheels to finish out the uh, 